stay here, I can't see no peace. Every time I look, I see the chief of police. Run me, they run me all night long. One with a club and the other with a gun. I was in my house drinking, I'll come home. Up I look with Mr. Dix and Mr. Wall. They said, hey boy, you need not stall. You ought to know I'm going to jail you all. Well, I'm going to leave this town, dear babe. I'm going to leave this town. Right, welcome back. We are back at the shack, the workshop, today doing some uh, chopper work. My favourite daffodils have come out and uh, the willow's starting to... Uh, oh yeah, it is. There, there's some leaves coming out on that now. But there's a few little issues with the chopper and before riding season really gets going, I want to make sure they are sorted. I went out on it yesterday and when you sort of give it some revs, it's bogging down. So what we think it is, one of the jets in the carb is probably blocked up because it hasn't had a carb cleaned for probably about a year, year and a bit. Um, but first of all, we're going to start the bike and we're going to check that there is no intake leak. Okay, let's go. We can take the carb off anyway and give it a clean. The revs didn't pick up, which means that it's not an intake leak. Yeah. But then revving it then, it was revving up through the RPM. So it's um, yesterday, it was like getting to, I can't tell you how many, probably oh, three. two, three. No, probably probably oh. two and a half. Oh. Maybe, maybe three, I suppose. And then there was nothing there. After it. To be honest, you're probably only revving it to about two there. It just sounds like um, how it is. Uh -oh. So we, we, we're just going to take the carb off anyway and have a little look and see if there's anything in there, a little bit of shit. Look at that, that is spotless. That is gorgeous. Wow. Have a look at the jets and make sure they're not blocked just to make sure that this... Um, Bogging down isn't a block jet, and now it's raining. It is raining. Well, I'm putting the Road King in. <laughs> I don't think I've got the yeah, little pliers anymore, have I? It looks pretty spot or something, really. So that looks all good. Oh, yeah, I, I know that song. Yeah. yeah. It's a good song, isn't it? Yeah, brilliant. Fire. Fire. I haven't touched anything like that. The carb is actually set up for summer riding. I admit there's a couple of days this week I've been working in a t-shirt. Yep. Um, it's been quite nice. It's not too far away so now is the time to get out in the garage and do the few little bits to make sure your machine's ready to go. As soon as that sun starts shining, I'm out of here. Look at that, lovely and clean. Picking that up. It's a little bit on the butterfly still, but yeah, I can't quite Let me go that. again, let's see again. Turn this up and slightly. There we are, look at that in there. Beautiful. Pop the car back together, or rather Max is popping the car back together. And I'm standing there with the camera. And we, we will pop it all back on, start the bike, actually let the bike actually get to temperature this time. Um, I could feel it when I came back yesterday when it was standing and I pulled up, I pulled the throttle. You could feel it do it then. Yeah. It was as if there was like a sort of, it was missing and there was like a bit of a backfire to it as well. So you can definitely, you can easily hear it if it's doing it again. The other thing you could do sometimes when this is the case is get it going, go on a nice bit of road where you can get a bit of speed up and just rag the fuck out of it. Well, 
gotta take this I'm getting warm. Yeah, I know. It's, it's, yeah. And then it looks like it's about to piss down over there. I know. Oh, you're running a bit rich. You're running very rich. Look at all that. Yeah, I know. It wasn't like that. I'm running rich anyway. They're black. Okay, right. The way I clean spark plugs is not with any uh, brake cleaner or anything like that. Just like this. Really does work really well, doesn't it? Yep. It is impressive. That'll do. There you, go, you can see all the. I don't know if you'd see that on the camera. Hey, you see where I've rubbed it? Oh, that was close. Really Come, dearest. Is your mic still on? You haven't touched it? Yeah. Ah, fuck! That's gonna be Jesus hot. Christ, that's not. That's gonna be proper fuck. hot. <laughs> She's running an absolute dream now. Just took her out, and um, when you give her full throttle, it just goes up through the RPM. No, doesn't skip anything, doesn't sound like it's backfiring. When we took the carb apart, as you saw from the video, we didn't actually find there wasn't an actual no, issue issue. It was just a bit black. Sometimes. I've found with these old motors, sometimes you just take them apart and give them like what Max did, just took it apart and gave it a bit of a clean out, put it all back together and it goes. Yeah, a bit of Maybe, a... Maybe, like we've cleaned the spark plugs, Max has cleaned the points. It could have been anything, it could have been a combination of all those things. But she sounds like she's running really sweet again, um, which is good at this time of year. It means when the weather turns, I can just get on and ride. We'll hopefully be back out on the road soon. As always, come along for the ride. Like and subscribe. We'll see you on the next one. Cheers for your help, Max. No worries, mate. And um, yeah, ride easy, everyone. Don't burn your leg on the exhaust. I'm gonna leave this town, dear babe. I'm gonna leave this town.